Parks, farmers markets, funerals, shopping malls across Lebanon. Sudden explosions erupted, sending thousands to the hospital and killing at least 10. This is a true event from the world of espionage, surpassing the imagination of any Hollywood 007 movie. Shocking not only the Islamic world, but the entire global military and technology communities. On the afternoon of September 17th, thousands of pages across Lebanon exploded at the same time. The pager explosion was said to target Hezbollah, a Lebanese armed political organization. The explosion killed and hospitalized nearly 3,000 people across Lebanon. It is known that the exploding pages belonging to Hezbollah were ordered from a Taiwanese company and sold to Hezbollah via BAC, a Hungarian company. This company turned out to be a shell company and was said to use their brand for selling products and that they were not involved in the manufacturing process. The above machines were interfered with by implanting explosives and remote detonation devices next to the battery. The explosive devices used were light, weighing only 28 to 56 grams. The time of interference was certainly before they were imported into Lebanon. So how were all the pages detonated? A unique code was programmed to cause the pager to detonate the explosives. When that code was sent over the messaging network, all the pages went off at the same time and exploded at the same time. The injuries were mostly to the head, hands and hips where the pager could be held and stored. No one has yet claimed responsibility. But all eyes are on Israel, as tensions in the Middle East are rising, and Israel has the most resources to carry out this attack, and Hezbollah has also vowed to respond extremely strongly to Israel after this incident.